hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel for today's video I was going to do a little bit of a night routine now this video is a little bit old a couple months old but my night routine has basically stayed the same so I start with putting miles down for bed I usually start his routine around 7 15 and that includes a bath let me get him in his pajamas a bottle of milk so story and then I lay him down in bed and then it is time for some me time my husband goes to bed fairly early because he gets up really early in the morning so the me time sometimes includes of getting the shower after he goes down to bed or before but on this night I decided to get a shower after he went down for bed once I lay him down for the night he is pretty much good he sleeps through the night now he has been ever since about July of 2022 so I'm really grateful for that after my shower I go right into my skincare routine I'm really trying to take care of my skin a little bit better and it's just a mixture of various little sample bottles that I've gotten through either Ipsy or FabFitFun. I just kind of go through those, whatever I have. And I also always make sure to put something moisturizing in my hair since I do heat style it every single day. I just straighten it, but it is still a heat styling and I want to make sure I'm taking care of my hair properly. My skincare routine typically starts with some sort of toner. So for this toner, they are just a little bit of a tonering pad. And then I go into some under eye cream. Sometimes I throw in a serum in there. I guess this night I wasn't feeling a serum, so I skipped serum. So I go in with some under eye cream and then just a all over face moisturizer. And then today I have this Damage Red Remedy by Avita, I believe it was, for my hair. I love the stuff, it smells so good. And I just let my hair air dry overnight. I don't like to dry it, it's even just more heat that I'm putting on it. So I just let it go and air dry overnight while I'm sleeping. I do wear contacts so obviously can't be sleeping with those and I do use a cleaning and disinfecting system this uses hydrogen peroxide to clean your contacts it just gets them really really clean After I'm all done with that, I head on downstairs and I try to tackle at least one chore. Tonight it was cleaning up the kitchen a little bit. This night I was doing the dishes, I was cleaning the bottles. So I popped on a TV show, I believe here I was watching Chicago Bed, and then I just try to power through some chores. I don't always do chores at night, but if I find if I go to bed with a dirty kitchen, I just wake up very overwhelmed so I like to try to get something done at least clear the kitchen a little bit is anyone else like that if I have a dirty kitchen I feel like my whole entire house is dirty Like I said, this video is from a couple months ago, so this is when he had his bouncer still and that is quite embarrassing to look at. So I needed to tackle this and clean out his bouncer. Sometimes I give him snacks when he's in his bouncer so all the crumbs get a little bit everywhere and he was also struggling with a little bit of acid reflux at this time. So 
you know, it just gets a little bit everywhere. So I'm just using a Norwax EnviroCloth to kind of wipe off everything and disinfect it, clean it up a little bit so that he is bouncing in a fresh, clean bouncer. And now to kind of shut down the kitchen, close it for the night, and have a little bit of just calming me time. So I like to get a snack before I go to bed. So I'm just looking for a snack. Sometimes it's a granola bar, a bowl of cereal, whatever it is. And then a drink for the night. I had some bubbly here, or buble, I like to call it. And then I just kind of go into the living room and I try to watch TV. I clean up a little bit of his toys, a little bit that is left out again. Try to tidy up the best that I can before I go to bed so that I don't wake up and everything is just a complete mess. So this is time that I really, really like. I usually just turn on the show, whether it's Chicago Med. Right now I'm watching New Amsterdam. It wasn't loading so I gave up and I just watched a little bit of TV on my phone for a little bit just to get some relaxing me time. And I do go to bed fairly early, I feel like. As you can see, the clock there says about 8.30, and that is typical. Um, I like, I need my sleep. I don't do well if I don't get a lot of sleep. So I usually look at my phone, which I know is bad. I need to cut that habit a little bit before I go to bed. And I just scroll through, get all the notifications off my phone, because I'm not one of those people that like to go to bed with a lot of notifications. So I just do that for a little bit until I get tired and then that is everything. I turn on my sound machines, make sure my alarms are set for work in the morning and I go to bed. 
you like these kinds of videos, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and I will catch you in my next video. Bye!